Hi, welcome to Simple Scuba. This is the Sunto SK7 wrist compass. It's a very versatile compass. It can obviously be reused in the wrist format, but it is modular, so it can be put onto a retracting system from Sunto. It can also be put into the housing for a console. So it's a very versatile system that can be moved into a variety of places. It's a very large compass, uh, makes it nice and easy to see. Large display on top, obviously phosphorescent uh, card for the compass, so obviously glow in dark situations if it's lit up. Big viewing pane in the, in the back, so obviously as you're navigating from the wrist you can look through the sides and see quite clearly your uh, bearing. Uh, waypoint or uh, bearing setter around the top, so you've got front and back, so forwards and uh, your return bearings. Uh, straight line on the front there. It's uh, possibly one of the most uh, versatile in terms of tilt as well. Most won't go anywhere near the same tilt uh, potential as the SK7, so as, as you tilt it, a normal compass will get stuck. Uh, so it won't, won't turn, it won't give you a true bearing. But this has a 30 degree tilt, unlike most, which have maybe 20 or 15 uh, degrees of tilt before it starts to, to incorrectly uh, show your navigation. So you've got 30 degrees of tilt before it will start to catch and obviously stop turning. So it's very, very good. And Sunto is where they uh, initially, you know, how the company is set up making precise navigational um, devices like this one. So it's exceptionally high quality and very, very precise. There's only two uh, versions of the compass as well. So you get a northern and southern hemisphere. Obviously ours are northern hemisphere, but there are southern hemisphere available uh, as well. Mount is on a rubberized boot with an elastomer strap, so very uh, flexible. Good uh, length on the strap as well, so it'll fit over thick suits, neoprene or dry, um, membrane dry suits. Uh, flexible piece on the top, so it does give some flexibility in terms of movement. So as you're moving around, it does stretch and move with your own movements, uh, so it gives you a bit of extra comfort as well. Stopper on the end of the wrist strap so it doesn't pass through the strap by itself so you can leave it like that loop it over the wrist and it won't come undone so you don't have to fiddle with trying to get the strap through, through back through the buckle and then it's just got a retainer so pop the strap underneath the retainer if you want to you don't have to it is a little bit fiddly pull it through and obviously that will lock in on the retainer pin there so keeps it nice and tight. So very, very versatile, very precise, and loads of tilt movement on that as well. That's the Sunto SK7.